Hey friends, welcome back to another exciting Dollar Tree video. In today's video, we are gonna take a little drive to a newer to me Dollar Tree and I can't wait to share with you guys what I found. So if that sounds good to you, grab a cup of coffee, get comfortable because we are getting into it right now. In my car, I'm trying not to be a weirdo out here, but um, everybody vlogs these days, right? A lot of people do it, so it's not too weird. Um, behind me over here is Grocery Outlet. So this is one of my favorite parking lots. It used to be the 99 cent only store, and now it's Dollar Tree, and it's a huge, huge Dollar Tree, and I did find, finally, my wish list item, you guys. I'm so excited to find the ghost mug, and I also found this guy, which I didn't even know existed. Super excited. I got uh, quite a few other items, which I will show you guys in a upcoming haul, but stay tuned because I'm going to show you all the new footage of the new store. Okay, I'm so excited to check this store out. This was once the 99 cent only store and it is a huge Dollar Tree now. So over here, I do see the four foot $5 trees right when I walk into the store. Now they were definitely well stocked with their to-go cups. So these are a three pack and there is a variety of colors at this Dollar Tree and I was very happy to see this lavender color. It is so pretty. It says instant happiness. And they also have this beautiful sage green, sip, sip back and relax. They also had a blue color, just one more cup. These are excellent at $1.25. You get three of them and my Dollar Tree didn't have all of this variety to choose from. So as I mentioned, they were very well stocked. We have these sweater mugs, which I have personally been looking for. They had uh, the red, which is absolutely beautiful. And this could be any time of year, really. And they also do have the green. So I was pleasantly surprised to see all of their mugs and cups. I also have never seen the sweater style in the white. So this was a really beautiful find. And down here, they have some larger mugs as well. They have a beautiful white with a nice textured design. And they also do have this in a light blue, which is my personal favorite. They also did have this in black. So as I mentioned, very well stocked with their mugs. $1.25 and they had this one. Now I did share, I do believe I shared a version of this at my other Dollar Tree, but I've never seen them in red. So this was a very nice surprise as well as black and white. Substantial size and absolutely just the perfect size coffee cup in my opinion. I don't like them when they're too small because I'm always refilling my cup when they're too small. Okay, let's see what else this Dollar Tree has. As I mentioned, very well organized and very well stocked. So I just kind of wanted to see what they had here in the food aisle. They have the Sonic, the Dove, the Snickers, and the Milky Way pudding, which was a nice surprise. So they pretty much had everything over here. I didn't get it because I'm not a huge pudding person, but I wanted to highlight it if you guys are. They have all of the cakes by Pillsbury, lots of different flavors. Down here, we have the Duncan Hines. They had a few different flavors, including a lower sugar version. That was hard to get out, a lower sugar version if that is your vibe. Just amazing, amazing products. Over here in the laundry section, they had a lot of the scent boosters. They had four different types to choose from, the orange, the purple, they had the pink and the green. I have never personally used these, but I hear a lot of people say that they smell very, very good. So if this is something you're interested in, $1.25 is a steal. Now over here, just another huge aisle of products. I want to say that as walking through the store, I noticed it was very, very heavy on the beauty items, which was something I was personally looking for. And I could not believe all the different cuticle oils that I found today. They had a mango one by Be Pure. They also had this one by Be Pure, which was a um, lavender cuticle oil pin. I had never seen this before. And they had the cuticle oil, cuticle oil balm, such a hard word to get out there for $1.25, substantial size stick. We have another cuticle oil and nail strengthener here by Be Pure. And you also have the nail polish corrector pin, which I thought was amazing. I could have highlighted everything in this area because there were so many finds that my personal Dollar Tree does not have, including this little tiny like travel size facial razor, two pieces in here for $1.25. The nails are the ones I'm wearing by Ladybird. Love them. You get 12 nails for $1.25. Glue is not included though. And they had several designs that I hadn't seen yet. I also highlighted this in a recent organizing video. So they had a lot of the makeup brush holders. They had some lip scrubbers. They had some eye massagers. They had some blemish extractors. You guys, they were just so stocked. Under eye massager. $1.25. You cannot beat this. They had 
these facial scrubbers with the reusable attachments each of these were $1.25 by Be Pure. Beautiful packaging. Eyelash case with a mirror. So if you have to travel by Sassy and Chic, they had two colorways in this. They also did have the bronzing drops, quite a few of them. I was surprised to see this because I have not seen these yet. I did not pick them up because it's winter and I'm not a real bronzy girl in the winter. But now I'm questioning my decision because I probably will need these in the summertime and I should have grabbed them while I saw them. Um, over here, we have a dual cream eyeshadow, it looks like. Super interesting by Be Pure. Had never seen this before. And I wanted to see if they had other colors, but they only had one color in that. They also had more of the Clean Beauty lipsticks, which I hauled yesterday, and I loved their LA Colors display. I thought it was just so well organized. All of the colors are together and organized very nicely and very beautifully. I was happy to see that they had the LA Colors lip liners, so I did grab two colors that I think will pair very well with my new lipsticks by LA Colors. I got a lot of the fall ones in a recent haul and I did swatch them. So I will link that video for you guys if you are interested in seeing it. They had a Vaseline all-purpose cream. They also had, what is this? Oh, a retinol skin cream by Global Beauty Care. They had a lot of the revitalizing dupes by Be Pure here. Just amazing at $1.25. Witch Hazel by The Lucky Brand. You cannot beat that price. Coconut Body Oil by Personal Care. And they also did have a Vitamin E Body Oil. Over here, we have the Cetaphil Dupe. Gentle Skin Cleanser by Be Pure. Substantial size. I haven't tried this, but this is definitely on my list for next time. They had a ton of the uh, Bath and Body Works Victoria's Secret slash Calvin Klein dupes over here at $1.25. I have almost all of them and I really do like them. They smell amazing. This is a huge facial cleanser for $1.25. This is by Fresh Start. And it looks like it's a vitamin C cleanser with some um, exfoliating beads. They had the smaller Yardley sprays, $1.25. Over here we have some Dermasil, night creams. Look at the power stick. So I do have this one, but I'd never seen it in this packaging. And they were pretty stocked with their Brazilian body mist as well. So you have the rose and Brazilian. Newer product to this Dollar Tree, and I had actually never seen this. It's a deodorant body spray, but I wanna make a note that it is $3 by Be Pure. Over here, you have the little scrunchies. You can put them on their on your wrist when you wash your face. Lots of body scrubbers and lots of bath, bath things over here just to have a nice spa night. We have some dry shampoos by Be Pure. Blossom and Crisp, I have never seen these. Lots of hairsprays by Flex over there. And we have more of the hair masks. So my Dollar Tree ran out of these, but they had a pretty good amount in here. And I always kind of like to help Dollar Tree out a little bit by organizing when I see things out of order. <laughs> so you might see me doing that. We have some Be Pure Hair Serum and a split-in fixer. I love these colors, very aesthetically pleasing. And I had never seen this Summer Vibes Hair and Body Mist by Personal Care. This looks very interesting. I have a lot of items I wanna go back and try. We also do have the Sea Salt Hair Spritz Personal Care. I have never seen this. Beach Waves looks very interesting. And lots of different hand soaps. Now, they did have the Delta, which I was looking for because I had not seen this in a long time. I did haul quite a few of these last year and it looks like they are starting to roll them back out. I don't necessarily like the plastic packaging, but I do like the amber color of the soap and it does smell very nice. Now they did have the body scrubs, they had some bath bombs by Spa Luxury, really good brand, and a lot of the twist shampoo and conditioners. Now I was tempted, but I don't really need shampoo and conditioner right now. But then again, it's always good to grab these items because they go really quickly. They had a nice selection of the tumblers. I did haul quite a few of these recently and I do love them. I still can't believe they're $8.25. They had a good selection also of their Unstoppables by Gain and Downy. Now these were $5, but if you go to Target or anywhere else, they can be upwards of $9 to $10. They had their Extra Care Laundry Detergent with OxyClean over here, $5 and a ton of organizers. And I was very interested in this section because I'm doing a pantry organization video for you guys very soon and I need those. Two interesting pumpkins that I had never seen. So I've never seen this purple color and I have never seen this decorative pumpkin with a spider. 
So two new items, you always see something new. Now over here also have never seen these either. I did not see them at any of my Dollar Trees. I have also not seen the spiced apple pumpkin. So it didn't smell like really that much, but I did like the container. I was very tempted to pick it up. This was a $5 candle and they had a lovely selection of florals. Now, because this is a larger store, you'll see in a moment that they also had a little Christmas section full of florals. Over here, they had the wallpaper that I just recently used in my bathroom video. And if you haven't seen that, I will link it below. I love this wall tile. I just used it in my bathroom uh, sinks and underneath the sink. Also one of my favorite papers. And this section was a little unorganized, so <laughs> just try to help out when I can and uh, just kind of put it back where it goes. That was like a Dunder Mifflin. I'm not really sure what that was. Looks interesting enough. And um, so we're moving on. But over here, I was very tempted to get this because I wanted to do some organizing in my bathroom. And I really do like this rose kind of gold color. And I feel like for $1.25, that's a really good price. I looked at it for a while, couldn't really decide, thought about it, thought about it. And then I was like, you know what? I will come back to this Dollar Tree because I have a lot of items on my list. Now moving over here, yes, I finally found the ghost mug. I have been looking for him, searching everywhere, and finally found him. So I am so excited to finally find this. It was a wish list item. And I also grabbed this one, which I didn't even know existed. And I was surprised to see that they had so many in stock. I also want to mention that this store was like very dead. There was only like two people walking around and it was like 11 o'clock. So I was surprised to see that 11 o'clock on a Friday. You would have thought it would have been a little bit busier as my Dollar Tree usually is. Over here, beautiful arrangements. Um, I have highlighted these in the past, but I don't know, something about it in this light in this Dollar Tree just looked really, really film worthy. Now over here is another section. This is like all of their fall decor, uh, Christmas decor that they are rolling out. My personal Dollar Tree has a lot, a lot of Christmas decor. And as I mentioned, this Dollar Tree was a little bit more beauty heavy. So I will need to keep that in mind. If, I if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, say hi in the comments below, and I will see you guys very soon in my next Dollar Tree haul. Bye for now.